Are you serious? Yeah. In high school you did that? Yeah. Yeah. Me and a team of other guys, but yeah. What does that feel like? That was the most uh that was the most inspired and proud I had been in my life up until that point. Um and I, and I would say roughly in order, something like getting to know Jesus Christ, having made precipitation, and getting to send something to the ISS were like biggest life accomplishments probably. That's pretty amazing at age 25. That's, that's crazy. Did you follow that experiment? Yeah. Um, you know, unfortunately, we broke one of the test tubes. So in one of the experiments, there was a bunch of glass in it, which was bad for the cell replication. Um, but uh, yeah, man, the, the other results were, and other people have studied this, um, that, that things grow very differently in space. One, because of radiation. Two, because, uh, you know, gravity and the electromagnetic field of the Earth um, has a very poorly understood impact on how organisms evolve. So, like, there's this company right down the road from me in El Segundo called Varda, and they launch uh, small orbital factories into space because um, if you don't have any gravity, you can synthesize all kinds of different materials that are too sensitive, essentially, um, to be made within Earth's, Earth's gravity. Um, and so they're doing all types of new drug discovery. Um, they're making much more efficient conductors. Um, we, 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 should, we should be making a lot more stuff in space um, just because of how much cleaner it is, how much more efficient it is. Um, and, and I think that we'll see some really incredible stuff in the next 10, 20 years because of it. What do you think we should be making in space? 